Yeah, there's Stu. Oh no. <laughs> Lunch is served. There you go, he can me. Piping hot. It's like, you know, that's the best use of exhaust I think I've ever seen. What do we have? Well, we've got biscuit and ribs. Ooh, all right. I'm down for that. Yes. Look at the steam factor. Oh, yeah, that looks good. All right. Let's eat some of that. <laughs> good morning, YouTube. Today, we're going to change out the engine mounts on this Ferrari 360. This is Stu. You guys have seen Stu, and he uh, just brought me lunch in the form of brisket and ribs. Kept warm by the 360 oven. The 360 oven? 360 oven, yeah, I guess that'll work. It's not a terribly difficult task, but we gotta take take the car, put it up in the air, pull off the bottom tray, and then pull out the engine mounts, and, and that's kinda it. It's fairly easy. So are you recording all of the nefarious activities? All right, Stu is grabbing the quick jacks. We're gonna throw the quick jacks under there, get this thing lifted up. So these are the engine mounts, and what happens is these guys are made of rubber, and eventually this rubber degrades and collapses. And when that happens, you can see this little square block, which right now is kind of floating, that will end up touching this pad. And that's how you know that these things are dead. So likely when we pull out Stu's, you'll see that that's what's happening. This is part number 182142. This is the updated engine mount for the 360. We're also gonna replace some of the bolts and stuff. This isn't necessarily something you have to do, but it's a good idea to do it if you want. So this is 1597634. It's a bunch of the screws. We've got the big bolt that goes to the center, one, one, three, six, nine, six, three, four. Some more nuts, one, three, three, nine, eight, eight. These are obviously the nuts that go here. We've got the lock washers, one, two, seven, four, nine, seven. And then actually, I don't even know what this retaining washer is. All right, so I was looking at the parts diagram on Rakami's website, and as you can see, this is the old solution. It has a different transmission mount. There's the new transmission mount, so that's the way we're gonna do it. That's where that big ring is, is right there in the underside of the uh, engine mount. Technically, Rakambi is not sponsoring this video, so I'm not flagging it as a sponsored video, but Rakambi is where Stu got all these parts. So if you're interested in going to Rakambi's website and buying some of these parts, go to rakambiamerica.com and use the code NGS10. They're gonna give you 10% off. So make sure you guys use that code and save yourself a little bit of money. They usually are sponsored on my videos, but this one, Stu must have just bought the parts. I don't know why, you, why'd you do that, Stu? I'm sure you would have gotten hooked up. Yeah. <laughs> Alrighty, Stu is unbolting the Millennium Falcon, aka the under tray, which consists of a crap load of 10 millimeter and Phillips because Fry doesn't like to do one thing. They want to make sure it's complicated. Oh yes. Stu is taking business calls underneath his car. <sighs> Keep on unbolting you. Yeah, yeah, mule. I oh, can't get to that one. Mule? Fortunately with the 360, 430, and 458, you gotta jack it up, undo all the bolts, drop it to the ground, get the last few bolts, and get the jacks out of the way so you can pull the stupid under tray out. There's no way around that. You just so you're gonna have to be lifting it, lowering it, lifting it, lowering it. I don't know why, but watching you struggle makes me happy. <laughs> I'm such a dick. <laughs> Here in the normal guy garage, we laugh at other people's mistakes. Oh yeah, it's called schadenfreude. <laughs> Glee from the misfortunes of others. So schadenfreude is when somebody takes joy in another's misfortune. Schaden, which is misfortune or harm and Freuda, which is joy. Oh, they missed one. You mean you missed one? Wait, nope. Wait, what the hey? It needs to probably come forward, or it's hung up on the front one. As many times as you guys have done this, I think you've got it down. It's always a pain in the dick. What it's the never hell? easy. Well, his car's too low and it won't come out, so I guess we're gonna try jacking it. Okay, perfect. I should be able to clear it now. Yeah, it should clear it now. Chewy, get us out of here! 
careful. Julie, get us out of here! <laughs> Good lord. Not to be pedantic about it, but if you wanted to keep the Star Wars reference accurate, it's a little bit more like a snow speeder. Just, just saying. Actually, yeah, but it's not as big. <laughs> yeah, actually, it does kind of have its look of the snow speeder, doesn't it? Yeah. Damn it! You're you're right. All right, up again. Oh, careful. Uh, what? What, what, what? Put it back down. You're pinching daylights out of your cord. Oh. There we go. Thank you. Other side's okay? Yeah. Thank you for noticing that. There's the left engine mount, and there is the right. And as you can see, just sitting here, there's a gap right there. Um, yeah, that's a, a pretty guaranteed sign that these are collapsed. So they're... They're, they're screwed. So what we're gonna have to do is we're gonna put a jack on the engine, jack the engine up just a little bit, just to alleviate the pressure off the motor mounts, and then we can unbolt the motor mounts. And uh, this is one of those where if you have an air impact gun, it's probably a good idea. Let's put it right there on that okay. circle. Yep, you are on it. Okay. Yes, sir. So then I'm gonna jack it. Just see the um, motor mounts, the engine mounts. Yes, right here. Tell me once they're uh, uh, they're kind of floating. Okay. Yeah. 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 A tiny bit more there. Oh yeah, definitely. Okay, good. Okay. All right. All right. So here's the impact. I'll put on setting three. We'll try the electric first. And then you'll need a 24. Let's put on top. You can't. You can't just do it. It'll just spin. Here's the. Put what on top? This oh, goes on the nut on the other side. And you have to do it by feel because obviously you can't see it. Ouch! That engine still be a little warm. Oh, there it is. Got it? Yep, yeah, yeah. All right, so then hold down on that and then use the impact and see if it'll come off. It might have enough balls, might not. Probably not. Never move. All right, so let's get the big guns. Okay, Stu, put on the impact. The impact. Is about to go. And let Just, me hold uh, on to this. Okay, thing. you're wearing glasses, good. Yes. Okay. Yep, fire away. Contact. Yeah, your arm's in the way. There you go. Ruined the shot. You ruined my shot. That's good. It's off. Ah, uh, yeah. Right in the face. Forehead. Now it should be able to just push up and pop out. Uh, yeah, move your face in it. Drop in the poo. I think we might have to jack up the. Yeah, so you know what? Oh, that's right. So you know what we gotta do is we gotta loosen the other one, and then we gotta jack the engine up. Jack the engine up to get clear. A lot, yeah. 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 Let's go to the other side. Mama. All right, you ready? Go for it. Blast away. Yeah, I think it's off all the way. Or is the nut not a nut? Off? There it is. Yeah. Let's see if we can save that bolt and nut. The bolt's good. Nice. Oop. Maybe. We'll see. After no, I just saw it. It looks really good. Yeah, that's reusable. <sighs> Woo, it's hot. This is definitely a <laughs> barbecue. Okay. Hold on a minute. Oh. All right. We so, successfully have so, all of them off. Stu, we have to start checking your parts oh, orders shit. for you now, too, man. Yeah. Okay. yeah. <laughs> yes, I don't know what I'm doing. So we need to jack up the car, the engine higher, so you can get the trans mount. Right. Out. Hold to up. Get it, Stop. Getting the crushed ones to clear 
it will be easier than getting the new ones to go in, too. Uh, no? Maybe. Well, we'll see. There you go. There's Smashy. Smashy. Yeah. So there's the height. Yeah, I, bet, I think that height's going to be higher. Yeah, oh, a little. Yeah, a yeah, bit. See, here's, here's, here's fit, the placement. Not... Yeah. Hey, Stu. Yes, sir. <laughs> That's what I think. Never gets old. <laughs> nope. Higher? Yeah. Right, keep your fingers clear while I'm doing it just because okay. I'm going to smash you. All right, maybe there. Hold on, hold on. Oh, she's oh, so close. There you go. Got it. All right, just got to rotate to the right direction. Yeah. All right. Well, let's get the other one. Yeah. Okay. All right, give it a shot. Oh, it won't clear? No. No. Dang it. Oh, uh, I like another pump. Uh, oh, that's what she said. That's what she said. Ooh. Oh, it stinks. What? <laughs> oh, nasty. Still. <laughs> nasty. That's what you get. Swimming in his own sauce. May have to drop it and then put the um, yeah, jack the, on the other side. That's what it takes. The jack's not centered up on it. That's what I thought. Okay. Let's do that. So, stay clear. Yeah, see? The back end of the quick jacks was lifting up yeah. off the deck. Ooh, that's fucking ah. scary. Yeah, it is. Wait, yeah, oh yeah, we're plenty of clearance. Got it? Yeah, and probably plenty of, oh, okay. do you want to film? It's already filming. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and here comes the motor mount. And yeah. the new one. Oh, yes. Nice. Yes. That is gorgeous. Your phone just lit up, and I think it was from Richard, huh. Dan, and I think it said something about the roof just flew, yeah, the roof just flew off this car. Oh, f*** ah. me. You kidding me? What? What? I'm going to send you a message about your car. All right, so you know how I've been kind of complaining about Turo rentals lately? So the vet's on one of its last two rentals that I was ever planning on doing before removing it from the system. Renter told me the roof just flew off, which probably means he didn't secure the roof correctly because it doesn't just fly off. So he, I'm sure, didn't secure it correctly, which this will be interesting to see whether he admits it or not, but he said it flew off and it's in bad shape. Can't wait to see this. So it's a bolt through the top, then oh, washer, oh, 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 oh. washer, lock washer, nut. Gotcha, now it makes sense, yeah, okay. You're supposed to do blah, blah, blah. Ugh. You didn't do it right. Probably behind me. I think it's always behind me. What are you looking for? Uh, the wrench? Yeah. It's right here. So Stu and Jeff are running to go get some new hardware since that one nut got destroyed in the one bolt. Well, the, the bolt we're not reusing, the good news is we did have another bolt. But I wanted to show you, this is what the motor mounts look like once they're collapsed. So you can see the rubber has smashed down and this top plate is kind of squished. So normally it's like that tall and now it's like that tall. This pad of rubber is almost touching the metal piece right there. So basically it's totally squished down. Effectively, the does nothing. They're no longer causing the, the engine to float. They're just squished. So the engine's just bouncing around a whole lot and moving around. So this is actually gonna make the car feel a whole lot better when it drives and shifts. Uh, yeah, it's that time of the night. Cheers. Cheers. Ah, yes. We had to go buy another bolt and the only bolt they had was really, really long. Wait, 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 wait. Why did we have to buy another bolt? Oh, because Stu only ordered one. Instead no, of two. Let's make sure. Yeah, let's. Oops. Give, yeah, I'm not give credit where credit is due. I'm not sure why, but we only have one. You're replacing two motor mounts, but you only buy one bolt. I, I, I. Yeah. <laughs> so it's too long. So, sawzall. Sawzall. Yeah. I don't know if I trust you with this. Power tools. Yeah, I don't trust him with this. Okay, are you ready? Yeah. I don't know if I am. Hold, Hold the on. Hold sawzall tight. Yeah, I got it. I got it. Hold on. <laughs> My workbench is on the ground now, like everything rattled off. What the hell? And your beer is foamed. <laughs> your beer started foaming. <laughs> well done. <laughs> Probably need to clean those threads a little. All right, we got to put in the giant massive bolt. Now that we have it, and it's cut to size. Here we go. It's, oh, I gotta freaking move this thing around. Yeah, you gotta move the, yeah. the mount around to get it aligned correctly. Oh, that was the... 
that other one. The old one. <laughs> That's yeah. Funny. Was that? Did you find the other? Old yeah, picture? it's all warped too. Yeah, I figured. No. Wait a second. Let's look at the diagram one more time. That was on the top. Right. That means that there's a washer on the top. I'm pretty sure you want the washer on the top. So that yeah, that's means what I remember when like that. You said you were yes. It against that. I was like, Are so, you sure? Yeah. There we go. I, See? I figured it went up against the nut. Yeah. We may have to jack it up and down a little to get it to align. Someone's got a Porsche. <laughs> That's the one cool thing about living here. I can hear all the cars out on the highway. <laughs> like, ooh, I'm sitting there working on something. I'm like, ooh, what's that? Someone's having fun. I know what stoplight you're coming from, too. Stop. No, I'm not on the pipe. There. See? Oh, 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 yeah. Oh, there. yeah, 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 yeah. Just a tiny yeah. little bit. Oh, did, did he finally gain so, so close. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I can see it a little bit from here. Yeah. Wait, you mean you're too close to it to see it clearly? Uh, yes, okay. that's it, yes. Yeah, that's, that's the opposite. And I keep telling you to get readers. <laughs> I have readers, but I don't get, have them with me. Or to get progressives in your dailies. That's not it. It's the same. Okay, good. Oh, thank God. Okay. Oh, yeah. I got it. Got it. Okay. Washer. No, wait, hold on. Washer here. Oh, I need to lift it more. Wait, wait. You might not need to do anything. Are these guys? Yep, that's it. Let's just see. Oh, can you shove it in the flashlight right there? Yeah. Thank you. Oh, look at that! It went right through. It, it went right in. through. Nice. Oh, we needed a win. Oh, no, I'm ah. fine. Oh. <laughs> 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 oh. <laughs> here. Oh, I just gonna point oh. that up. There we go. That's fine. There. Oh. Ah, there's the nut. Hold up. Nice. Check the orientation. Yes. <sighs> Just for you. And that nut is a little tricky to start because we cut the threads, but it does go on. Oh, God, Dan. Oh, God. Oh, I'm tasting it. Oh. Oh, 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 it's, oh it's horrible. Oh, oh. oh it's me. It's the brisket and ribs. Oh. You should get it to yourself because it's from the food you bought. Yes, yeah. it is. That's your fault. <laughs> <laughs> wrong. Uh, All yes. right, it's on. All right, I'm gonna lower the engine. Okay. Hands clear. Everything clear. There it goes. Yay. Yay. All okay. right, so the four bolts that secure the engine mount are tightened to 38 foot-pounds, which is 50 newton meters, and the big-ass bolt in the center goes to 98 newton meters, which I'll have to compute. I think that's about 75 foot-pounds, if I remember correctly. We don't want to have a Richard torquing experience. Look, Mom, I'm torquing. Yeah. Well, you're not going to break these <laughs> bolts. I would love to see you snap that big bolt in the center. Because if you do, then we're immediately signing you up for the ah! USC. Yeah. <laughs> I'd break the necks. <laughs> you ready to roll? Oh, yeah. There you go. Oh, okay. It's all set. It's ready to do. Perfect. Now, next. because we're still being filmed, I'm going to the opposite bolt. Yeah. Cool. All right. All I'm right. Just gonna get the center bastard. Can you Google what 98 newton meters is in foot pounds? Sure. 71. Uh, 72. 72. Okay. Oh yeah, Richard never came by, huh? What a loser. <laughs> He's not cool. He's not welcome here anymore. <laughs> He's like, hair, unless, his, it, unless it's with my Ferrari, I'm not. I'm not coming to help and support. He's his hair is too nice. I don't like him anymore. Use that much? Put the impact on it just to get it in there farther. This was the old one, right? The old bolt. I think that's why it's being a bitch, because the threads are probably all hosed. Wait, is it? I thought. Yeah. Oh, I thought I I, I thought you guys used the old one on the other. Or the no, other. remember we were trying the new one, and then we switched to the old one, and then. Yeah. Nope. Uh, oh! Oh! You okay there? Yeah, what the hell are you guys doing? Getting that wrench off? You have to hit a, a hammer. Oh, up off the top? Yeah. There it goes. It's off. Yay. 
And now you just have the hour long process of the Millennium Falcon putting the uh, snow speeder back on. Uh, mm -hmm. We should probably start calling it that. <laughs> I agree with these. No, two. this Millennium Falcon's more popular. <laughs> There's more toys. There's those snow speeders in all the episodes. I had one. Yeah, man, I, I had one like, as a kid. I like the snow speeder better, man. That was one of oh, yeah. my favorite scenes. We will take that, a that song. Dun, 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 in the morning when you're taking the ride when they're looking for someone. Yeah, yeah. I, I remember seeing it in the theater. Like, we will take an online vote. It was okay. Will 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 it be called from forever on a a snow, snow speeder, speeder or a Millennium Falcon? Falcon? That would be the latest. Time for the snow speeder <laughs> to go under the car. Millennium Falcon. <laughs> Shoot! Get us out of here! <laughs> Good God. <laughs> Just don't damage you. Uh, 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 you're upside down, you're upside down, and backwards. Yeah, yeah, there it is. See? That that looks pretty close. <laughs> yeah, the song! Yes! The song! <coughs> oh, you're backwards. Oh, yes, I know. Rogue one! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Stu is under there attaching the bottom tray <laughs> slash. Millennium Falcon slash snow speeder. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever devices you're choosing. That's it. That's all it takes. All right. She is ready to hit the ground. You're going to notice such an improvement in how it drives. Yeah. Seriously, when it shifts. Yeah. It's going to be so much better. When I did mine, I was like, oh my God, it shifts so much better now. I can't wait. Yeah. I can't wait. <laughs> Well, the vet's in the garage because uh, I have no roof, so uh, <laughs> it's uh, banished to the garage for a little while. Megan is going to be very pissed about that. It's a Wait, true, you need a roof? It's a true, I know we can get one roadster. Right here. I got, yeah, I got a nice used roof. <laughs> yeah. Slight damage. It's a true roadster. All right, there you go. That's it. That's all it takes to do those engine mounts. They're pretty easy. I mean, you, you are going to need an impact wrench, so use an impact gun, save yourself. Otherwise, you're going to need a really big breaker bar. It's going to take forever. We're going to be wrenching, 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 so. Please. Oh, yeah. Miller. Miller. Please. 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 That would be the best. That would make this year, if I can get Miller Lite to sponsor me in 2020, oh, it would be the most epic sponsorship. Come on, Miller. You know you want to. For those of you that aren't Miller Lite, if you would like to win one of those clocks, yes, this clock right there, you can actually win that clock. Once I hit 50,000 subscribers, I'll give it away to one of you. All you have to do to win, subscribe to my email list or buy one of my merchandise products. Go to normalguyssupercar.com. That's where you can sign up to the email list or buy one of my things. Also make sure you subscribe and share these videos. So doing those things gets you automatically entered. Again, 50,000, it's going to one of you guys. And again, go visit Recami America, even though this video technically wasn't sponsored by them, they've been pretty awesome. They've hooked us up with tons of stuff. So use the code MGS10, get 10% off. They're hooking you guys up because that's awesome, and they're awesome. Daniel Pass is awesome. Awesome. Make sure you order awesome. two bolts. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Get, yeah, you need eight bolts of the little ones and two of the big ones. You will definitely want new bolt hardware because we destroyed those bolts. Make sure to do that when you're doing this job. We have a ton of car stuff coming your way. You guys are going to want to stay tuned. It's going to be sweet. Ah, yes. Got the echo. <laughs> <laughs>